Okay, so this is a water distiller. Uh, so what we have here is a simple heating element. So it's glowing red, just like a toaster glows red. It's just a hot element inside there, and it's boiling water. So we've got boiling water, and that's just tap water uh, that's coming up, and then we've got water vapor, the steam, that's coming up, and then that steam comes over and up into there. Can't really see it, but it's in there, water vapor. And then it goes up, and it goes up into here. Okay, now here, this brown thing is just plastic uh, tubing, and that is also cold tap water coming in. So this is called the condenser coil. And so this condenser coil is what allows the steam to cool down. So the energy is transferred from the steam into the cold water inside the coil, and then uh, as that happens, the steam condenses back into water, and you can see it dripping down. And so that water is dripping down, and it's uh, just simply, simply collecting into this uh, large jug to collect all of our distilled water. So the cold water that's coming up through this brown tubing, up through the coil, and then just simply comes out the top of the coil. At the top of the coil it's a little bit warmer, because there's energy been transferred from the steam into the water. And then that water comes down, and then over, and makes us back in to the system so that it can start the process, so it can start boiling. Okay, so this overflow line right here, that's just a, that's just kind of a check valve to make sure we don't get too much water in the system. And so this goes down, goes behind there and goes underneath, and then just goes down and up to the drain. And this line is the original cold water line that's coming up into our system. So this is a little lab distiller to create distilled water.